Polish builder Zbigny has been left homeless after being evicted from his rented room. The officers decide to take him back to the property to see if they can resolve the situation. There's no one to knock in, drop him off in the city centre, show him where the council office is and where he needs to go, and then he can get a place to stay. Hello, you okay? All right, to come in? Yeah. Hello. No, no, not him. It seems the woman who was letting the room is refusing to change her mind. They don't want you to live here because you've been drinking. Well, yeah, I'm not drinking. They say you are. I'm, I'm not, I don't care if you have or haven't. It's irrelevant. They don't want you to live there, so you're not allowed there anymore, all right? Interpreter, can you explain to him that um, he has been subletting and therefore he, he won't be able to get his money back? My money. As a police officer, there's only so much you can do towards certain situations. <clears throat> what can we do? We can't get their money back that they've lost or we can't help them in any way because... We're not a social worker, we're, we're a police officer. Yeah. Do you have no money? Do you have any money? No. Working. I work, no phone. Yeah, 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 I know. Nowhere to sleep, nothing. No, it's okay. Not bad for a Doesn't have any money, anything. Do you know what? I'm just going to get really good. There you go. Okay. That's all I have. Yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know. Just keep that and you can buy some food, okay? Okay? Of course, my friend. Okay. I'm really sorry, mate. I'm really sorry. Look after yourself, okay? Okay. Okay. News has got back to the squad sergeant about an incident that happened earlier on Jamie's shift. Right, Gary, right, Chair. Yes, sir. First and foremost, thank you for joining us on shift. Tell me about the homeless chap, or the chap was asked to leave. Yeah, his so, house. so then we had a Polish guy about 60 years old, was crying, and um, he didn't have anywhere to go. He was telling me how cold his hands were, and I. Uh, he had no money and I gave him uh, 20 pounds. Okay. You're un I'm hoping you're going to understand. I do understand, the, yeah. I do understand. The problem with that is, as police officers, first and foremost, we deal mainly with crime. Whilst at the time, he's yeah. going to think, that Jamie, brilliant bloke, should that happen again? And the expectation is, well, hang on, where's my tenor? Well, I'm sorry, we don't do that. And we'll have people yeah. out front of the station yeah. saying they're homeless and we can't deal with that. Got a little bit of a ticking off. Call him Sarge. Yes, Sarge. <laughs> well, I, I get it. I do understand. And I, and I just got to understand that you can't do that to every single person because if you did, then you're setting a standard that you can't achieve, right? Um, I still feel bad for him though.